Hey guys, Realistic Gaming here, and we are back on Percy and the Beast Productions channel because you guys just can't seem to get enough of this sort of Fallout stuff. We are going to continue off the videos in order. So last time we did watch episode one, which was the Brendan Babe last, and now we move on to episode two, Boko Comes Home. It is pretty short, as you can see, so in this video, we might just watch episode two and three. Just so the video could be long enough, you know, over eight minutes and whatnot, all that YouTube stuff that YouTubers do. And guys, if you guys want a shout out on the next video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, like these awesome people have done already. <laughs> Alright, so let's begin with our first video. Oh, cool. So it's actually the intro for like every other Soda Fallout video. That's pretty neat. Oh my god, James. <laughs> that scream is funny. Oh, the duck. He is shaking. Under his nuts and bolts not fall out, dude. Shout out to Percy and the Beach Productions, man. Go check him out, subscribe, all that good stuff. And of course... Timmy Thunderbolt. Dude, I get excited to watch these. They're like little movies. <laughs> we got a call from an Did July 5th, 1973. We found out he came back to Zelda after taking a goods train from the mainland and went straight to Brendan Docks. Alright, Boko, I see you, man. All right, so there goes Boko with all the goods. <laughs> What's up with his face? Oh, he's admiring the beautiful skies. Nobody told Frank and Marshall about the power plant, so they drove him straight into the contaminated area. I've been told they haven't come out of their lives. Oh. Well, that's not good, is it? Somebody should have warned them, dude. Oh, they're gonna be mutated, aren't they? Freaking knew it. Oh my gosh. Dude, they messed up my boy Boko, man. All right, well, that was very unfortunate for Boko, man. He should have just gone somewhere else. All right, so since uh, episode two was kind of short, we are moving on to episode three for this video, which is James Tragic Demise. McBun Bakery. The next morning, a crowd of people forced their way out of the ticket office next to us to raid and see Bun to get some food to eat. Something got to them during the night. We heard them screaming in fear, and they didn't get back to the room. We covered all the windows with drapes and blankets so that we didn't get hurt if something else happened, like another explosion. I really hope they're okay. It sounds too similar, man. We would happen 2021 when the lockdowns began. <laughs> Edward was okay. 2020. I couldn't believe it. Edward was still there. He was scared, and some of the coaches were badly burned, but he was okay. Edward was low on coal, but he did have enough water left to make it to Tidmouth. If engines would be hiding anywhere on the island, it's there. You got this, Edward. We believe in you, buddy. <laughs> Why is he just staring at him? Weirdo. Is that who I think it is?
Yeah, it is James. We were shocked to see James pull up to the station with empty coaches. He seemed pretty pent up about something. Since he was taking his anger out on Edward, we didn't know what was going on in his mind at the time. But Joseph told me they left half of their train at the platform instead of getting them all aboard before the blast hit them. But by the way he was acting, James definitely saw something the rest of us didn't. Hey, sometimes you gotta make a little sacrifices, you know? Not Ford. After laying about in the station for about an hour, we thought it was time we left. Felix and I were talking about how scary it was to run away from such a disaster. We've all decided to entirely ditch the idea of going to Tidmouth and head straight to the Vickers Down Bridge. And off they go. Oh. That boy Zoom and Iron Man. Fast and the Furious, part 10. While we were heading down the line, Edward had to stop for water. Felix made sure James didn't slow down and shot right past us, hoping to get across to the mainland. However, they went on the wrong line and went straight to Sunday. No, I haven't seen them since. It took the wrong track. Freaking noobs. The heck is all that stuff, man? It looks like ancient. Wait, is he mutating? He is! Wow, and he crashed head on to that. <laughs> Dude! It seems like James Brakes gave out at the end there. All right, you guys. Well, those were some sort of Fallout videos, part two, episode two and three. Now we do have. Did he make a new one? Oh, he did make an episode nine. So we do have about what? There's nine episodes. We've seen three. We have six more to catch up. Well, if you guys want me to continue to keep continuing off the series, you know what to do, man. Smash like on the video and all that good stuff, and I will catch you all in the next one. Perfect, perfect.